Hey, welcome to the video. So Xtool sent me their D7 automotive scanner to review and how convenient. I just bought this 2010 Ford Fusion Hybrid and it is throwing some codes. So I'll use the scanner and see what we can find. Comes in a nice hard case. So there's the scanner. It's got some weight to it. Obviously comes with charging cords, plugs, and the cord is already plugged into my car. Oh, I gotta go through the whole setup. So when the scanner's on, this is your screen. This is also an Android tablet. So you have like apps and internet. So you can do all kinds of different stuff. If you want to see what exactly you can do, just pause the video. Do an auto scan, it'll scan your car. automatically scan all the modules that are on your car. Lots of little issues with this car. <laughs> well, let's look at what the code is on the PCM. Uh, it's going to test all the different functions of the PCM. And then it gives you the problems. Got a little O2 sensor problem. Probably because this car is 215,000 miles and it's old. <laughs> of course, you can clear the code. If the code comes back, you know you got a real problem coolest thing about this scanner is that it is a full two-way scanner so when you're in a specific module you can click actuation test and you can activate every little thing I can open the trunk I can turn on the fog lamps, the high beams, the horn. Everything that the module can do. Oops. You can turn on the fuel pump, turn it off. You can disable injectors. Turn the O2 sensors on and off, spark advance, all kinds of stuff. Not in the transmission, the module doesn't allow 
two way. Let me turn the battery fan on and off. This is a hybrid car, so it's got a battery. A big battery, I mean, not just the starting battery. There are a lot of modules on this car. it you can do a lot of things with this scanner of course you can read live data whatever kind of data the module puts out the scanner will read can record the data of course you can do your regular OBD2 scan which will list out your you can read live data all kinds of different stuff and read your OBD2 codes of course, I deleted mine just a moment ago, so it's not going to show up. And you can manually choose your car. For the more in-depth scan that we did before, this just takes you to the same spot as before. With all this, all these modules. other parts of this scanner you can do some remote control I guess you could connect other devices to it play back your data that you saved chat with X tool Well, that's about it for the XTool scanner. This is actually a powerful scanner for the price. If you want to check it out, I'll have a link in the description to where you can buy it. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this. If you have any questions about this scanner, put them in the comments. I'll do my best to answer. 
hopefully the community can answer as well. 